Okay, so I promise that all, all of them are here. Okay, let's see what we're gonna do. It's quite exciting, then. Uh, mm. It's like a mission. Hi, Becky. Hi. Okay, this workout has been picked by. Been sort of invented or I don't know, created by Kim Stewart, which is not here. <laughs> so, it's called the Claymore, and I've got it here on my phone. So, it's going to be a 25 minute arm wrap. It starts. <laughs> <laughs> so, the rep scheme will be two, four, six, eight, and so on until the 35 minutes end. And the movements are burpees, okay. overhead squats with an odd object. So burpees, overhead squats. Then we've got skipping or jumping jacks. Uh, times 10, okay, so 24 years for one. I'm not here to do that. No, that's not what that was. Have you all gone muted? Right, okay. Yeah. The speakers won't all fuck up, sorry. Okay. So, are we, are we there? Okay, so, burpees, overhead squat, skipping, sit-ups, And finally, push-ups. So, what we need after the warm-up, okay, so the warm-up, we're gonna do the warm-up first, but anyway, what we're gonna need is um, an object, okay, an item, whatever, I'm gonna use the weight vest for overhead squats. If you have a dumbbell, obviously, you can use that for single arm overhead squats. Uh, you can use a kettlebell, anything like that. If you have a barbell, fine, absolutely fine. As a high volume workout, it's gonna be 25 minutes, it's not extremely long, but just to say that the overhead squats cannot be extremely heavy for you, okay? It cannot be too heavy for what you usually have. Anyway, <clears throat> anyways. Now, let's go, let's get into the warm up first. And if possible, from now, you can mute your microphone, unless you want to sing in the meantime. The warm up is going to be three rounds of three movements each. We're going on the minute. Minute one is a full minute, so 60 seconds of heel flex, butt kicks, whatever you want to call it, okay? So going up and down this way. Then the minute two, 30 seconds of push up, bike, stretch, back to push up and bike, okay. And 30 seconds rest. And minute three, high knees for 30 seconds and 30 seconds rest. We go around three times, okay. So final space, gonna set the clock for um, the three minutes, the uh, nine minutes. Okay. Everybody ready? Starting with butt kicks. So make sure you kick your butt. 10 seconds. Try to stay as high as possible with your chest, so not going backward or uh, forward. Let's go. Just the first part of the warm up. Take your time just to get your pump strings ready to go. And increase your heart rate. Keep that nice posture, guys.
all the way through the middle. That's good. A few more seconds, then down into a plank. Starting with push-ups, knees or toes, and then stretch up in the high position. Okay, plank. And go. Push up. Pike and stretch. Again. We only do this for 30 seconds or so. Full range of motion. Take your time in the stretch. A part of this exercise. Okay, the 30 seconds are gone. You can take this as a little rest before going into the high knees. So high knees, as the name says, we really want to focus on this rather than speed, okay? So try to keep the height of your knees higher than your hips when you do it. So not great fit, okay? Two, one, go. Move your hands accordingly. So alternate right hand, left foot, left knee. Doesn't have to be super fast. Knees up. And rest. Okay, round two, butt kicks. It's going to be the whole minute. Ready, three, two, one, and go. Awesome. Halfway. Keep kicking up as high as possible. Okay, plank. Ready for push up. One push up, one stretch. Push up, um, head and chest through. Take your time there. Nice job. One more. Stretch, and we can rest. Next up is high knees. Nice. Okay, then you go. Three, two, one. Knees up. Hold it 30 seconds. Ten more seconds. Good. 
rest one round left Okay, last round guys, third, one, heels up. Very good. Top out speed, just keep it going for the minute. Try to get those hamstrings to work. Aim for your butt. Full, 20 seconds, and then push up position. Okay, hands down. Two, one, push up, stretch, straight arms, head through, and next. Get a couple more. Okay, get a little stretch. And you can rest. We only have the high knees left to go. Ready, 10 seconds. Okay, just the best you can get. Good, one, up with your knees. And rest. Awesome. Okay. Let's proceed with the second part of the warm up. So we need couch, chair, step. Well, high step. Uh, we're going to stretch this way, guys. So one arm. Try to push your chest as low as possible, okay? Straight arm and stretch down. 60 seconds on one arm, 60 seconds on the other arm. I'll give you a few seconds to get ready. If the, there is no way you're gonna find something like that, hands up. Okay, okay, don't see hands, so I'm confident. Okay, 60 seconds, start one side, ready to go. Straight arm, and start. Straight back, straight arm, good. Okay, keep it going, coming. Let's see how we're getting on. Try to stay there. We're doing 60 seconds each side. So one arm first and then the other. Mm -hmm. A few more seconds to go. Okay. 
Straight back, straight back. Okay, rest on other side. Everybody ready with the second arm? Again, make sure that your elbow is locked and push your chest lower than the bench or couch. Three, two, one, go. Very good people, we still have 30 seconds, we will take Almost there. And rest. Good job. Now, if possible, if you can retrieve um, a broomstick, okay, something that is similar to a wooden pole, that'd be good. If not, that's fine. It works more or less the same. But if you can go get it, that'd be good. Give you 10 seconds to take it. Would the band be okay, Val? Say again. Would the band be okay? Um, or not? No, yeah. Um, if it's quite long, yes. If it's a short band, not really. Yeah, but it's what? Okay. So, uh, we're doing 10 reps of good morning. So, if you have this or similar, goes on your back. Okay. If you have a band, band goes around your neck. Okay, so you step in the band and it goes around your neck. If you have nothing, works the same. Okay, elbows here and stretch as far as you can with your knees, okay, with your hamstring. Make sure that your knees are slightly bent, okay, you're not too far out in your uh, stance and straight back. 10 reps. Let's go. Good, guys. Just stretch, take your time. Straight line on your back. Don't compromise your spine, okay? You want to keep your spine as straight as you can. If you go too low, and you start to bend your lower back, just means that your hamstrings are not flexible enough for that depth. Nice job. Once you've done 10, keep the, the pole here, keep the broomstick here. If you have a band, Try to put it in a back squat position. If not, that's okay. And a little wider stance. And we go for 10, as upright as possible, back squats. Okay, try to keep that nice upright posture when you do it. Okay, avoid this. And go as deep as you can. 10 reps of back squats. Very good. Don't get too complacent just because it's a lightweight or even a non-weight, okay? We wanna be working on our posture, okay? Elbows underneath the bar, not behind, or just as, as pushed forward as possible. Really good. Once your 10 reps are completed, the bar stays here, well the bar, whatever you've got on your shoulder stays here. This is quite impossible with an elastic band. I'll show you with the 
um, with the pole first. So stand, elbows up. You can do it with one elbow, you can do it with two, one at a time, okay? As long as both elbows go up and down 10 times. Now, if you do it one at a time, please try not to do that, because that's nothing, okay? So this stays at exactly parallel to the ground. Push and up and down, okay? So 10 times each or 10 times if you go both up and down. If you do it with a band, just forget about the band and do it just like this, okay? Let's go, 10 reps. Very good, Vicky, well done. Yes, Derek. You can close your grip a little bit, Rachel. Maybe makes it a little bit easier. Good, push, push, push. Don't stop where it's comfortable. Just get a little bit of a stretch. That's amazing, Jackie, well done. Nice. Just 10 reps, 10 each side or 10 for on both. Okay, last 10 reps. Using this posture, okay? Using this, that should be warmed up by now. We do squat and press also known as thrusters, okay? Simulate a heavy weight thruster, making sure that your hips come through, reach full extension, not here, not here, just above your head, okay? Straight back, back down. Elbows up. 10 reps of thrusters. Try to imagine it's the heaviest possible weight in the world. Catch the bar with elbows as high as possible. Lock out at the top. Mm -hmm, good. Try not to compensate with your lower back, Davy. Just stretch your shoulders up. Yep. Brilliant. Okay. So that concludes the warm up. Now, the what? The Claymore what? Chosen by Kim Stewart. Um, I'll remind it to you just for, a, for the second time, okay? So it's going to be two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, whatever reps for a 25 minutes AMRAP. And exercises are burpees, so chest to the ground. Up, jump, overhead squats. If you got a barbell, overhead squats will look like this. If you have an odd object, you decide. Okay, so with something like this, for example, I can put one arm and do some reps, and then another one, or I might choose to go with both hands up. This is really up to you, depending on the shape and weight of the object. Then skipping, if you can skip, amazing. Double unders, single unders, just remember it's times 10. Uh, if you've not, if you don't have space or a skipping rope, what you can do guys is jumping jacks or jump double top. Okay, twice when you're up in the air. Then sit-ups, usual sit-ups. Feet together, down, up, stretch through. Okay, so touch the ground in front of your feet. And the last one, push-ups. On your toes, on your knees, as long as they are um, always engaging your core and full extension. Okay, so find the overhead squat weight I'll set the timer for 25 minutes. 
and we want to go as hard and fast as possible. Okay. Ow. Yes. See the jacks. You just this. do two, four, six, eight, ten of them, don't you? It's times ten. For the jacks. Yes. Yeah, so skip. So that skipping, jumping jacks, or double tap is times ten. Okay. So it's gonna be twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, whatever. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is that clear for everybody? Yeah. Awesome. That's a 25 minutes of work. And we want to keep it as fast as possible as long as reps are done correctly. Some of them are not too technical. Some of them will become very hard to do, like push-ups, okay, and overhead squats. So let's get this out of the way. And we should be ready to go. 25 minutes. I'll leave the timer in sight. Pam, so, so could you just go over the exercises again? Sorry. Yes. So, exercise number one. Barbies. Exercise number two. Pick an item and overhead squats. Exercise number three. Skipping or jumping jacks, or double tap on your hips when jumping. And remember, this is times 10 reps. Then sit ups. And then push ups. Okay. Okay, I'll take it as a yes. Okay. Ready, 10 seconds from now. Let's work hard guys, starting with two reps of each. Four piece, three, two, one. And let's go. Moving on to overhead squats. Skipping, remember it's time 10, so it's 20. Set ups and push ups. Now it's four of each, okay? Up and two, guys.
Come on, guys, keep pushing. We're three minutes in. So remember to find a sustainable pace. Nice job. Good push-ups, Core. Cool. Well done. I feel we're going to do a lot of jumping jacks here or skipping, but that's why we are in elite fitness, guys. Good. Make sure you keep it going. It's a 25 minutes workout so we don't want to stop halfway through okay five minutes in plenty to go Great job. So, when we do push-ups, guys, 
Let's make sure the hips and chest move at one, as one, okay? We're tempted to get a bit wavy. Try not to. It's not a huge amount of push-ups we're gonna do. So, keep it solid. Wow. Yes, Paul. Okay, look, uh, double unders go 24 to 60, 80, 100. Yes. Thought it was that hard. So you can scale it. You can do singles. But yeah, that's how it's meant to be. A really good or a squad deck. Well done. Not sure what you got in your hand, but it looks really good. That's amazing. Come on, Andy. Let's go. Everything looking good, guys. Just make sure that you're over it, squat. Keep the nice straight posture. Very nice, Colleen. I know it's a small way you got, but can you try to stretch your arms straight? Well done. Beautiful. Good.
Right. Jumping jacks all the way out with your hands. Come on. Let's keep it nice and tidy. No lazy reps, guys. 10 minutes to go. Very good form, Joe's. Try not to lean too far forward, Rachel. Stay up with your chest. Yes. Nine minutes, guys, come on. Beautiful squats. Yes, Claire, well done. Nice. Very flexible. Make your jumping jobs or skipping or jumping top quite fast. That's the cardio part, guys. That's where we want to go really fast. And then doing our reps our best way possible.
Come on, Davy. Come on, guys. I know it's hard, but not long to go. Got about five minutes left. We've been through 20 minutes. Try not to wave, Derek. Hips away from the ground. Just at the same time as your chest. That's good. Yes. Keep that posture on your overhead squats. Okay, two minutes. That's when we work the hardest, guys. Try to get to finish your round. Get as far as you can into the new one. Come on, 20 seconds. Five, four, three, two, 
One, and rest. Oh. Well done. That was great, guys. Great effort. Really good. Oh. What's here? No problem, family. So, this was the main part of the warm up, of the workout. Warm up? <laughs> well, definitely feeling warmed up. Now, we've got some accessory work to do. Uh, if you want to stay for doing it, I'm happy. If you need to go, that's totally fine, guys. We had our share of strength and, and sweat. So, uh, for this, you need a lightweight, okay? So for this, you need something definitely lighter than five kilos, let's say five at most, if you're really strong. So I'm gonna grab a small dumbbell or small kettlebell over there, because with the weight vest, it's quite impossible. I'll show you what if. So, in a split stance position, meaning that we are on the catch of a split jerk, okay, or to start a lunge, like this, straight arms, and we go one, two, okay, three and four, then swap side, one, two, three, and four. And we do this for 10 times, okay? If you want to do it, you don't have to. So grab a small weight. It even works without a weight, but obviously you can make it a bit more challenging. So are we all ready? I'll set a time cap of eight minutes. We can't make it eight minutes. Well, something is really too hard, okay? So 10 sets, four and four. Everybody ready? If not, say something or move somehow. Okay, 10 seconds. Grab your little weight. Three, two, choose one stand. As far out as possible. Okay, straight arms. On the floor. Swap. Straight. One. Two. Three. And four. I'm gonna rest for a few seconds. And let's see how we go on. That's good. So the idea is in a split position, okay? So we wanna have our feet quite distant. It's about how much we can twist. We're gonna feel it on our shoulders, the shoulders are tired after that workout. But it's the twist that counts, okay? Let's try to get the second set done. Okay, we might be tempted to compensate by, by leaning back, something like this. Let's try not to do it, okay? We might need a lighter weight if that happens. Hey, right, come on, set three, four and four.
How are we the weight best coach, Emma? You're like the strongest in the world. <laughs> okay, let's shake and let's proceed with the sets. Should be 10 in total. We're gonna stop at, 10, at eight minutes anyway. So we've got five and a bit minutes to go. Very good, Chloe. Well done. I say, Helen, beautiful twist. Yes. Make sure as your abs doing the work. We should twist externally, so towards the leg that is forward. So our abs work a bit more. But to be honest, it's not a great problem. We should still feel our abs working. So try the next set, rotating externally. That's it. Your chest is following the dumb, the, well, the dumb, the whatever you're using. Yes. Really good, Derek. Make sure we are not quite in a split position, a wide split position. Okay, not just a tiny split, like open. Okay, distant legs. Good, Rachel. Well done. That's a good position. That's perfect. Nice, Becky. Looks much better now. Well done, Jack. Is that ten kills, Jack? Five. Okay. Oof. I was gonna say. Arms and split, chest is following the weight, okay, always pointing towards the weight. Still have two minutes to go, maybe a round or two, like a set or two, before we end. Oh, Vicky has left us. <laughs> you're hiding, Vicky. Now you're like, oh, I've done 10 sets. Okay, let's try to get one more at least. Well, maybe even two. Let's see. There's still one minute to go if you need to get some reps done.
Okay. Well, guys, I guess that is it. That's our workout done. Thanks to Kim Stewart that made it up and then didn't show up, but it's good because we did it. Thanks, Sal. Oh, thank you, guys. That was good. Thanks, Sal. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, Sarah. Bye, Alex. Bye, Bye. Bye. Bye everybody. Bye. 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 Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.